welcome back to Toy Transformations. My name is Shell and here I am with another awesome video for you. I'm gonna show you how to transform this Barbie doll, this Ken doll, and this LOL surprise dolls into the punk boy family. That's right, a family is part in one of our favorite LOL dolls. So if you want to see how they end up looking, stay tuned with me. Let's get started, friends. First, we're gonna transform Punk Mom. So let's fix her hair with a little bit of her gel. Let's comb it like this. And with this neat shade of teal acrylic paint, we're gonna paint this part of her hair. She's looking super punk already. Then, we're gonna use some midnight blue acrylic paint for a small strand of hair. Just a thin line like this one will do. And one of my favorite features of Punk Boy is his neat sheet of spots and the side of his head. So let's paint some. Since this is a doll we used for a previous transformation, we're gonna need to cover up all the paint. So for the top part of her body, we're gonna use some jet black acrylic paint. And for her legs, let's use a little bit of Arctic White. Make sure you cover up really good, friends. Now we can start making her neat outfit. Let's use this Barbie top as a stencil to trace the shape on a piece of white fabric like this one. Then you can cut it out with your scissors. And since we're gonna need two of the same pieces, we folded the fabric so we can cut them both at the same time. Next, you need to stick both pieces of the top together. Just apply some clear glue along the edges like so. Once the glue is dry, turn it inside out to hide the flaps away. And with some of this scarlet red acrylic paint, we're gonna paint a few trim around the neck and the sleeves of the top. Now, let's make that tea look super punk. Let's paint a cool text with some knit black. You can also paint the name or the logo of your favorite punk band, like Green Day. And we need to make a cool flannel shirt so she can wear it around her waist. So let's start by tracing the shape of the shirt on this piece of felt. Then we're gonna cut it out with our scissors. Be very careful, friends, as for the help of a grown up. And next, we're gonna paint the sweet checkered pattern with some black and some blue. Then you just need to tie it around her waist. For her neat black bracelets, we're gonna use this fox letter. We need to cut out two thin strips that we marked previously. And to each of the strips, we're gonna attach some of these tiny gemstones that are gonna be like studs. Now let's put everything in place and Punk Mom will be ready. Punk Mom looks tough as nails, guys. I think that my favorite part was her flannel shirt. And look, we even put on these deep fishnet thighs and these sick boots. Let's move on to Punk Dad. This candle will be perfect for him, so let's start by painting his hair with some teal acrylic paint. And for this part of the hair, we're gonna use a little bit of Peter blue acrylic paint. You can leave the other side of the head black. Now let's add the sweet sheet of spots. We're gonna use some teal paint over the black part of the hair. He's gonna look pretty tight, 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 tight. Time to trace his teeth outfit. First, we're gonna make his teeth. So let's use this good one as a stencil and shape it on a piece of black felt. And let's cut out two pieces with our scissors, like this. Now, we can stick both pieces together with a tiny bit of clear glue. Wait till the glue dries and then turn the teeth inside out. And for the pants, we're gonna do a pretty much the same. First, trace the shape on a piece of fabric like this one. Then, cut the out with our scissors. Of course, be extra careful. And then, fix both pieces together by applying some clear glue along the edges. Now, it's time to add the punk touch. We're gonna give his pants the same deep checkered pattern we used for the mom's flannel shirt. They will match perfectly. And for his footwear, we're gonna be using these camp stickers. But first, we're gonna paint them all black. Time to make some cool accessories for him. First, let's use some more of the fox feather to trace two thin strips like these. Then, cut them out. These are gonna be some sick bracelets that are gonna make him look super punk. 
and just like we did with the pot, we're gonna attach one of these tiny gemstones to make them look like subs. Next, we need to add a deep text to his tea. So, for this black tea, we're gonna use some Arctic white to write the word travel. He's almost ready, friends. We just need to add the last details, like this band-aid on his arm. Come with me to see the final result. Wow, friends, Punk Dad looks like a punk rock star. He reminds me of the Madden Brothers from Good Charlotte. If you know that band, tell me in the comments below. I love them. Let's move on to the next member of this punk family, Punk Boy. So let's start by giving him a sick mohawk crest with some mercury clay. Now, we're gonna grab our modeling tool and we're gonna use it to make that mohawk look simply spiky, like these friends. Then you can trace some lines to give it some texture. Let's give his mohawk some color. For the sides, we're gonna use some of the teal acrylic paint. Don't leave a single black spot, friends. And for the crest, we're gonna use some of the midnight blue acrylic paint. He looks super punk already. Now, let's add some deep highlights to the tips of the mohawk. This is scarlet red, it's gonna look pretty sick on him. And now, just like we did with his parents, we're gonna give his hair a deep cheetah design. Let's use a tiny bit of jet black for this. These pair of LOL shirts are gonna be great for him because they already have a shirt around the waist. So let's paint them with some jet black acrylic paint. And we're gonna paint this top as well. Just wait till you see him, friends. He will look pretty rad. For the knit shirt around his waist, we're gonna need a little bit more of red acrylic paint. Now, with another thin marker, we're gonna give the shirt a super sweet checker design. And with an ultra thin brush, we can add the knit text to his tee. Now, let's paint the bandit on his knee. Knee will make him look pretty tough. For the final touch, we're gonna apply a thin coat of clear nail polish to both of his eyes. Come with me to see the final results, friends. Here we have him, friends, the awesome bug boy. With that neat mohawk, he reminds me of Travis Barker from League 182, another sick band. Our last transformation of the day is gonna be the sweet punk girl. So, we're gonna start by painting her hair with some teal acrylic paint. And we're gonna paint this side of her hair with some midnight blue acrylic paint. Now, we can add the cheetah design. For the midnight blue part, we're gonna use some teal acrylic paint. And for the rest of her hair, we're gonna use midnight blue acrylic paint. Let's start by painting her outfit. First, we're going to use some Arctic white for her thighs. Then, we're going to use this fine point permanent marker to paint the fishnet tights. Just some crisscross lines along her legs will do. This LOL top is going to be perfect for her. But first, let's paint it with some deep black acrylic paint. This is going to be a cool leather jacket. Next, let's use some Arctic white acrylic paint to give her a neat white tee, just like these friends. Now, we need to paint this skirt with some of the same scarlet red we'll be using for the rest of her family. And with our fine point permanent marker and some paint, we're gonna give her skirt a neat checkered texture to match the rest of her family. Don't forget to add the text to her tee, we want it to say trouble. Next, we're gonna change the color of her eyes. Let's use a tiny bit of coffee brown acrylic paint. Be careful not to paint the pupils. And she's almost ready. We just need to apply a thin coat of clear nail polish to both of her eyes to make them look super shiny. Let's take a look. There she is, friends, the awesome punk girl. She certainly reminds me of Hayley Williams from Paramore. I think all the members of this family can be punk rock stars. That was it for today, friends. Here we have our amazing family inspired by Punk Boy. First, we have Punk Dad with those neat pants and the cool accessories. Next to him is Punk Boy. I think he was my favorite transformation with that deep mohawk. Followed by Punk Girl. I think she looks adorable, but she's pretty rad. And finally, Punk Mom with those awesome fishnet tights. 
If you love these transformations, give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell for more fantastic transformations. We love you so much. Bye-bye.